And if I had to distill the biggest problem with the inspection and remediation industry down to just one thing, it would be this. It's like the Wild West. And because the mold spores are microscopic and odorless, you can't see them, you can't smell them. So you, as the homeowner, have no idea that the remediator that you hired to remove the mold is making the situation way worse. In fact, only seven states require the person remediating your home to be licensed or certified. So that means in 43 states, more or less, I could go to bed tonight and wake up tomorrow and call myself a mold remediator. Yeah, so the first thing to think about is that the mold sensitized clients look like uh, you and I and anybody that you see on the street. Um, they can be young, they can be old, they can be male, female, children, adults, uh, high schoolers, whatever. The mistake that most people make is the visible mold. And so, so many homeowners, they go, well, I don't see the mold anymore and I'm done and things must have been done well. And no, no, that's half of the battle, right? The other half is cleaning up all the microscopic stuff because you're not having health reactions from the visible mold colonies. You are having health reactions from the spores and the fungal fragments that come off of that colony. You know, the one space we should feel safe in is the one that has threatened our family's health and safety, um, our home.